Hey booze, so I'm finally home and this is the first fancy vlog back at home since all my travels. I'm gonna be here for the next three weeks. So I told myself I'm gonna completely renovate my house in these three weeks. I just want to, I've been wanting to do that all year. If you guys didn't see my last video or my previous videos or my social medias, I am completely turning this house pink. So in my last video, you guys got a teaser of my new room. It's still not finished, but my bed and everything is set up. Today I'm gonna be running errands. I'm gonna be shopping the new Halloween stuff and Bath and Body Works and Marshalls. But today I'm gonna be emptying out the sunroom and I got new luxuries that I'm gonna show you towards the end of this vlog. This is gonna be an all-in-one fancy vlog, home renos, shopping, interior decorating, haul and luxuries keep watching just popping in here with today's sponsor these sleek and affordable bags and luggage are base luggage and it was created by actress shay mitchell base has kind of thought out everything you need for a piece of luggage 360 degree gliding wheels, a cushioned handle, built-in weight indicator, washable bags for your dirty clothes, and all the interior pockets you need to keep organized. Anyone who has seen my can story time video knows that I went through an experience where I lost my luggage internationally and I had checked the bag in that I had lost and I have this new fear now while traveling that I'm gonna lose luggage and there's no lock. So, I wanted to get new luggage that had a lock on it and I came across Bay's luggage, the most aesthetically pleasing chic luggage that I'm actually so excited to walk onto a plane with in a blazer, beat face. I'm just so excited. These are so adorable. I have been thinking to myself for the past six months, I don't think my luggage is cute. I have my certain pieces of luggage that I just don't bring around anymore. I just want something that's durable that I could bring everywhere. And can we just talk about how girl boss actress Shay Mitchell created this company? Like that is amazing. This is just so aesthetically pleasing. It just screamed that someone with traveling experience and style created these. <laughs> Thank you, Shay, for this beautiful luggage. I'm super excited to travel nice and chic now. So this luggage comes in multiple sizes and colors and for shorter trips, there's this weekender bag. It even has place to store your shoes separately, which is super creative. I feel like shoes is the one thing that people really forget about when designing luggage because that's the hardest thing that I found when packing, is packing shoes. I feel like there's so much storage offered in both of these bags. This is all I would need to travel for like a week or two. Right now, Base is offering 15% off your first purchase by visiting basetravel.com slash demartino. So go to basetravel.com slash demartino for 15% off your first purchase. That's B-E-I-S travel.com slash demartino. So that's it for today's sponsor and let's get back into this vlog. So this is the bag of the day. I did notice there is like a bronzer stain on here. So if you guys have any recommendations on how to get a canvas bag cleaned, let me know in the comments down below. Look at all of this laundry that I have to do. I have to play catch up today. That's literally what today is. Like I'm trying to get my life together today. So we're gonna bring this to the tea room in my house to put all like my teacups and china and stuff, but we're gonna paint the back of this tea cupboard like a metallic gold color and probably touch up the white paint on this. Also bringing some stuff from this room to my new house. Sorry I'm out of breath, I just carried that shelf to my car. But I'm bringing this iconic box that has been in so many fancy vlogs and these like antique wine glasses, champagne glasses, and this mug and found these Louboutins. Don't know what these are doing here, but hey. So now my lingerie chest is over here and this looks way less crowded over here. So this is my tea room. I love it so much. It's so girly, I'm obsessed. I'm putting the cupboard right here since this is a very plain wall. And yeah. So before I go to Marshall's, I am gonna go ahead and do some dishes. I have a lot of organization going on over here and I'm gonna get all like my china and like teacups together and put them in the cupboard that's going in the tea room.
I wanted to show you guys this skirt I got from Gold Hinge. It's like a workout skirt. And it's like sheer and it's really pretty. It looks like a ballet skirt. So I actually want to show you guys the plan that we have. Whoops. Let it, let it focus. I want to show you guys the plan that we have for the yard. Having landscaped next month. We're using Teco Block Industrious Slabs over crushed stone to give like that Hamptons vibe. We're having some planters all around the yard and we're working around the spa being right there. And I don't know if I showed you guys, but like the perimeter, like the wood frame around the hot tub is like a blush pink, just like the shutters and front door. So I'm just gonna go for like this very kitschy, like super girly, almost like Minnie Mouse house, fairy tale home vibe. So yeah, this is what the plan looks like. Okay guys, so it's the next day. Yesterday, I ended up getting my hair touched up. I was gonna vlog it, but I didn't because it was just taking so long, I was so tired. But this is what it looks like. I'm back to like a bleach platinum blonde. I'm super excited about that for the end of summer. Right now, I'm wearing this really cute like vintage blouse as like a nighty from Goodwill. And I don't know if you guys can tell, but the vanity is in a different spot. And that's because I'm rearranging my closet. It's a part of like my renovations that I'm doing, but I'm not gonna do an official tour until, you know, the whole master suite is done. I'm gonna tease it a little bit because it's like a mess over there on that side. But then over here is all my new items that I got for the fall season. I'm preparing for the Gabaween season. That's why I'm renovating my whole house now because I want my house to look exactly how I want it to look for Gabaween and Gabmas. So without further ado, I'm gonna show you what I got. So for fall, I always think Burberry. I saw this at the airport in London and I was like, this is mine. Love the pistachio green whenever you get anything Burberry. So I got a skinny Burberry necktie for fall. Look how cute it is. I'm gonna show you how I wanna wear it. So I then got these shoes from Dolls Kill because obviously Marie Antoinette vibes, let's be real. And I have to show you in this box. It seems so pointless for a purse. This is a purse, but I think this would make really cute decor. There's like a little bird in there that I have to take the bag off of, but I just felt like it was so whimsical. Like, just look at that. It's just so gorgeous. I got these shoes for my London performance, but they didn't come in on time. So these are just gonna be boots that I wear with my Halloween costumes or for the Gabaween season. They're so cute with the little sequins. Then got this really cute customized package from Shabby for me. So thank you so much for curating this just for me. So I got this pink ring. I got this Gabby bracelet, so cute. This pearl bracelet with ribbon. These beautiful, beautiful necklaces. Oh my goodness, I'm in love. And either a necklace or a bracelet wrap. I'm not sure, but it's so cute and it's perfect for summer. Everything is so aesthetically pleasing and goes together. I'm so in love right now, oh my gosh. I was also sent these Alina Haunch headbands. They are so gorgeous and padded and pink and embellished and satin, just so cute. I feel like in the Halloween season, I love a good headband. So this is all so perfect, thank you so much. And there's more headbands in this box. These are just so gorgeous. I was not expecting this many headbands. And this bow, oh my goodness. Wow, absolutely stunned right now. So I stopped at Bath & Body Works and picked up a pumpkin carving candle because even though it's super, super early in the season, I just really need to kick off Gabaline with a candle. So this is going in my new room. It smells so good, guys. I also got this cool friend hand sanitizer and I got this cute little like bedazzled ghost to put on my car keys. I don't know if you guys can tell I was obsessed with the smell, but I got pumpkin carving diamond shimmer mist and I got a candy corn lip gloss. 
So I got this top. I felt like this was so adorable. It looks like the cage purse that I just showed you guys, but it's a shirt and it looks like a corset on a shirt. So because it's a fitted top, I thought that was just really cute. And got this shabby chic dress because why not? I know summer's ending, but I saw this on the website and I love it so much. I could see myself doing like a photo shoot in this dress. I then got this corset. It's really giving Marie Antoinette vibes with the little ruffles going down and the bow. I love this. It's really good for like going out and wearing jeans or wearing like a frilly skirt with it. I feel like you could dress this up in different ways. I then got this like really frilly dress. It looks like a cupcake and has a big bow on the top. I went to Home Goods and I got this pillow for the sunroom. I'm doing a makeover in the sunroom, so I'm not, I don't want to give too much away, but this I feel like would look really cute in there when I redo it. I got these champagne truffles. I feel like they would look super cute in my new bedroom when I set up the champagne cart. Last but not least, I got this fall wreath. It's so glam, I love it. I love the contrast with like black Halloween decor and pink. I'm so happy I got my fall haul up. I feel like I'm always the first one to do it in like August. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys, I saw like one green leaf or yellow leaf fall off a tree today. It might still be on the roof. I was over there and I saw a yellow leaf just fall off a tree and I was like, that's it, it's fall. This is my sign that it's okay to post my fall haul in August. Good morning, booze. I just woke up to a message from Facebook Marketplace. I'm so excited right now. By the way, I did not sleep in a choker. I just got dressed up. I'm actually all dressed, but I'm just chilling in bed. I woke up to a message on Facebook Marketplace from the woman who is selling this beautiful like French provincial love seat and I'm getting it for my closet. But listen to this, it's not just any love seat. It's Rogers and Hammerstein's daughter's couch. That's insane. You guys know Cinderella is like my favorite, seriously one of my favorite musicals. And it would just make sense to have his daughter's couch in my cottage palace. I'm gonna show you guys the outfit I put on to pick up this couch. My room is like a mess right now because I'm still organizing, so ignore the boxes. But this is the outfit that I'm wearing to pick up the love seat. I'm like playing the part to pick up the most beautiful, iconic love seat. So I'm wearing this like frilly skirt from Dolls Kill. It's like lace. And then I'm wearing this vintage top that I got from Amethyst Lullabies. This bralette from there as well. And then I'm wearing just like a ribbon and a necklace. I'm so obsessed with old furniture. So today is just gonna be such a good day. I'm so excited. On the way to get the couch, we passed this like little hut with fresh vegetables. I'm picking up some tomatoes and fresh basil because I want to make a tomato mozzarella capri salad. And I'm getting some peppers because I don't I want to do the cream cheese taki thing with the peppers, but look how sweet. I love how trusting it is. Like you put money in there. We have like little bags. So sweet. So as you guys can see, there is a love seat in my back seat, and I ended up getting this yesterday. I just haven't brought it into my house yet, but I realized I did not film an outro for this vlog, and I'm gonna film that right now, just so you could get a little teaser of this couch. I don't wanna do like the full-blown room makeover in this video. I wanna show you guys the setup in a different video. As you guys know, I'm just doing so much to my house, and I just don't wanna give too much away, um, but I love you guys so much. I'm about to go lay at the pool and edit and I'm getting this video up tonight. So I love you and I'll see you in my next fancy vlog.